hello everyone in this tutorial we will see how can we admin uh, edit the admin menu okay you can see this is the wordpress default admin menu i have installed woocommerce so there are some woocommerce menu here i have elementor this is the elementor menu uh, there are default appearance menu plugins menu users menu tools settings and there are the default home and updates menu post media pages comments contact okay so if you are a site admin you may need to access uh, some menus frequently uh, so uh, if you want to rearrange this order by your uh, uh, choice of uh, choice you can use this plugin to modify the uh, admin menu here okay there are some other features too we will see or check that plugin out okay so let's go to the uh, plugins area click on add new search for admin menu editor This is a very flexible plugin. You can see the admin menu editor. It's by Janice Ellis, if I'm not wrong. Okay, so let's click on install now button. It's installing. Let's wait a bit. taking a little bit time okay the installation is complete now click on the activate button to activate the plugin so the plugin is activated okay now uh, let's see our plugin is admin, uh, activated admin menu editor let's go to uh, you can find the uh, settings here let's go to uh, settings and menu editor okay now you can see their existing menu is listed here uh, graphically okay so first menu is dashboard it's here it has two sub menus home and updates you can see this one post have four sub menus you can see this one uh, if you click post you can see the there's four sub menus and there are medias pages so i will uh, rearrange uh, the uh, admin menu by my own choice i am uh, i frequently use plugins area so i will keep into the top after that i will use tools settings appearance okay uh, and users so I, all the administrative uh, things i bring on the top after that, uh, after that, I will add a spacing before the WooCommerce uh, area, and I will uh, products is uh, should be here. Elementor will go here. Comments will go here. Uh, post media pages, okay. Templates will go here contact we will go here uh, now i think it's okay this is co uh, uh, post related area this three uh, three uh, this is commerce related and others all the others is settings related so i am happy with this one i will click on save changes now you can see my uh, menu is uh, just like I wanted WooCommerce for WooCommerce if you want to add extra spacing you can do that too okay let's click on save changes so you can see it's beautifully uh, rearranged as per my uh, ordering okay so there are some other features in these plugins let's go to the redirects you can see you can redirect any users uh, uh, after login or after logout after registration or after uh, first login redirect okay uh, if you want to do a uh, to a user let's say when admin user logged in i will go to the directly to the plugins uh, uh, page i can do this here if 
okay then you can uh, modify this after logout if you uh, let's say for administrator role after logout they will go to the, uh, they will go to uh, to a it's not here available okay let's remove this one let's say after logout admin user will go to redirect to the ad, uh, home page i will click just this one that's how you can uh, manage uh, after uh, logout redirect after registration redirect you can do um, uh, define here after first login redirect you can define here okay so and uh, uh, you can hide uh, uh, install menus uh, for the other user except for admins and this is the plugin settings area uh, who can access this plugin this is the general uh, things okay uh, you can uh, highlight new menu items you can uh, pos uh, new menu position uh, maintain relative order or, or uh, add new items to the bottom okay there are some other things you can enable debugging if you face any errors okay that's uh, i think uh, it's a very useful plugin who manages site wordpress site um, hopefully it will help you a lot uh, in your uh, regular day-to-day -day work that's all for today i will see you in next one bye